Hey guys, Spartan117GW, and today we have another review of another seahorse case. Now, if you saw my last uh, seahorse case video, that was based on a rifle case. This one, we're actually taking it downsize uh, for you pistol fans out there. And uh, what this case essentially really is, is a, is a system that allows you to, um, you can customize the foam if you really want to, uh, but it more or less allows you to carry you know, four different pistols and about three or four mags per pistol. I mean, total, total about um, 12 mags, uh, but you could actually probably stuff a little bit more. Uh, starting with the externals, this one is in tan. It's also available in black. You have the uh, large carry handle here, very handy, especially when you're just you know, moving in and out of vehicles and stuff like that, and you need to just grab it. Um, and it also features the same padlock system. And again, what I like about this system, if you refer to my previous video, is that not only does it latch, but it also has you know these these rotating locks essentially um, just gives you extra layer of security and it does have uh, basically a pressurized um, purging system uh, you'll know like um, if you you know lock the system and you put extra weight on it or I mean even coming off an aircraft or something like that you'll notice as soon as you um, you know crack the seal it'll immediately um, start to vent a little bit of pressure and stuff like that of course like when you open it uh what's kind of cool because it kind of lets you know that you know how well and how well the seal is and if you're not familiar with seahorse cases you know their background originally is you know obviously with a aquatic gear kind of equipment camera equipment stuff like that um and you know and what's great is you know protective cases they're fairly universal with all kinds of different things especially firearms so without further ado let's uh crack this baby open so you guys can see what's inside now, as you can see on top, you have more or less typical foam in here, and instead of pluck foam like the rifle case was, this one actually has a pre-cut, um, very uh, dense uh, foam um, uh, insert in here, essentially. And you can see the four pistol setup. I actually have um, Lee Force 1911 right here. Very, very nice pistol. Um, the case is really um, practically perfect for 1911s in terms of length. Um, you can get away with a couple different other ones. You know, I have a um, you know, VFC from Smart Imports, uh, Smith & Wesson MP9 compact, really nice. Um, and as you can see, everything just fits really well. And you know, this is really something that's great for, say you're an airsoft team, you do CQB only, use gas pistols only. Like there's, there's teams out there who just use gas pistols. This would be perfect for you because, you know, for like LTD, for example, because they got a whole bunch of different custom pistols and high caps and this, that, and the other. You could have all your different pistols, your backup pistol, your primary, everything all good to go. And it carries 12 mags. I mean, I don't even have enough mags to, to fill all the uh, available space. As you can see, there's four on each side on the front, as well as two more right here. So it's actually, uh, um, yeah, 12, <laughs> it's four, four. Four. Okay, gotcha. Uh, but what's cool, you know, like, you know, whether it's a, you know, Elite Force One with the CO2, everything fits very snug and it's all very, very secure. But you also have this open cavity in the middle. And, you know, like I said, if you are a gas blowback user or something like that, perfect place to, you know, put your BBs or whatnot. Um, but if you also happen to be doing real steel, you know, that's the perfect place to put your, you know, your box ammunition right there, more or less, and any other tools or cleaning accessories you may or may not need. Like, if you're a pistol guy, this is kind of like an all-encompassing, you know, case where you can, you know, carry all your pistols, all your mags, and everything in there. I mean, pretty much, I don't even know if you'd really need a, <laughs> a range bag, per se because this more or less kind of does all of that. Uh, but it's really cool though, because especially for transportation, especially if you're traveling, especially if you're moving things around, everything's protected in this nice hard case. Um, I also have my Tokimaru Glock in here, really nice pistol, um, but um, yeah. Hopefully those guys won't get pissed. But yeah, as you can see, if you are a pistol guy, this is like the perfect case for you. And you know, like I said, I've got a couple different types of pistols in here, a couple different types of mags. And you know, these uh, these little um, slots for the magazines, they're they're fairly adaptable. Whether it's a thinner mag like a 1911 or a thicker mag for M uh, M P9 or something for uh, oh yeah, the other M P9, the uh, standard height. Uh, but as you can see, it is. Pretty dang wonderful too. And when it comes to securing the case, I'm just gonna close it again. 
So you just put the latches down, then you rotate these suckers right there. Now these things are not coming open and it's, it's pressurized. And within the build of the case, you have the two molded portions right here so you can actually throw in some master locks or anything like that. Um, you know, these cases, they're wonderful. I, you know, I've flown with the larger one. I haven't had a chance to fly with this, but I'm fairly confident just as much that this one will take the same level of beating. And I do like how like uh, on the inside, Everything's pre-cut, pre-molded, uh, very, very nice, high quality, very dense foam. And you, know, you can get custom inserts for this. Say you have a camera system, or say you have a completely different system, or an MP7 or something crazy. You can actually get custom inserts for these. You know, this whole insert just pops out, which is actually really cool. So if you're not happy with this particular setup, getting a hold of foam insert really isn't that hard and more or less will kind of complete your day. You could have a couple different inserts if you really want to and use the same case and just kind of swap them in depending on where you're going, what you're doing, you know, what games you're going to or what range you're going to. So whether you're a real steel shooter or a camera guy or this, that, and the other, or you know, an airsoft player or anything milsim, um, definitely a really solid case for you. Um, I'm really excited about this. I think the LTD guys probably dig a lot. You know, their gas blowback team down here in SoCal, and they more or less pretty much just run pistols, so it's pretty dang awesome. So make sure you guys check it out. It's the Seahorse SE630 Fox Fox Papa 4. It is a mouthful. I'm still trying to get a hang over the nomenclature, uh, but um, yeah, it's not uh, it's not bad at all. Really nice, high quality. That's a good size too. It's about I think uh, something like 17 inches long. Uh, about can't remember exactly what the height was, but it's you know it's relatively um, very uh, easy to transport too. And like I said, because it's a hard case, you can secure it. It's great, it's good to go, it's gonna protect your equipment, and that's, of course, the purpose at the end of the day. So make sure you guys check it out, see horse cases. They do a lot of great stuff, um, a lot of different options on their website, but this one, definitely digging it. So make sure you guys uh, hit them up. Um, they also have Instagram as well, and uh, thank you guys for watching. Elite Force BBs, that's what's in my mag. Thanks for watching.